guys, for today's episode, we will make homemade burger. But before we start, Marcus wants to say something. Come to Mumbai's Cuisine, huh? For our ingredients, we have 500 grams of ground beef. I-transfer lang po natin ang ating ground beef sa malinis na lalagyan and then i-mix. Haluin lang natin kasi masyado silang close. I mean, dikit-dikit. Then, let's add two eggs. Make sure lang po na haluin natin itong mabuti para ma-spread natin yung egg sa beef. And let's add 1 tablespoon of flour. Mix lang po ulit. Pero kung meron po kayong breadcrumbs, you can use breadcrumbs instead of uh, flour. Good job! Then, let's add minced garlic. Pero, depende po sa inyo kung gano'ng karaming garlic yung gusto nyo ilagay. Then, add onion. If you will serve this with your kids, konti anyo lang po kasi some of the kids doesn't want onion. Then, mix lang po nating mabuti para po maabsorb ng ating beef ang lahat ng ingredients na inilagay natin. At para maging mas malinam ng pa ang ating beef patty, maglagay tayo ng 2 tablespoons of oyster sauce. Then add black pepper and salt. Depende pa rin po sa inyo kung gaano karaming pepper ang gusto nyong ilagay. Let's mix well until maabsorb ng beef lahat ng ingredients. Good job! Mga beshi, mas maganda kung kasama nyo yung kids nyo habang ginagawa nyo to kasi mas ma-enjoy nila yung burger na kakainin nila. Aww. After nating mamix lahat ng ingredients, i-form na natin ang ating burger patties. At kung wala kayong burger maker kagaya namin, gamitin nyo ang inyong palm. Set in the palm of your hand, and gently squeeze down to flatten into patties. Wow! Much better kung yung kapal ng inyong patties ay 3 cm. Good job! Then, put it in a plate. Kung meron kayong cling film, pwede nyo muna tong takpan and then i-fry nyo siya after 30 minutes. Good job! After 30 minutes, ready to fry na ang ating burger patties! Mga beshi, make sure na naka-low fire kayo kasi most of the time, sunog yung labas, then hilaw pa yung loob. Good job! Flip lang natin to cook the other side. Meanwhile, toast lang natin ang ating buns para hindi siya masyadong sagi and to make the burgers easier to eat. Since ready na ang ating patties and buns, here's our other toppings. Let's put our patties first, then add ketchup or hot sauce. Then add Japanese mayo, or you can use normal mayonnaise. After mayonnaise, let's add cheese, tomato, white onion, and lettuce. Para mas loaded, 
Let's add more cheese! Presenting our homemade burger. Hope you like it. Thank you so much for watching. Happy Cuisina Cooking. And please like, subscribe, comment, and share. And shout out to Tita Ni from Vanessa Algaspangan, Roma Algaspangan, and Markiel Del Rosario.